Hello everybody, my name is Gavin, and that's my cat Ruby joining us behind. Um, for my cumulative project, um, I chose listening and perception. I actually couldn't choose between the two, so I chose them both. And essentially, um, I just compared and contrasted listening and perception. They're both really related in a lot of ways, and they're also different in some ways. Um, I did a research paper because I thought that would be uh, easiest for me, just the way I learn. Um, I, I learn usually through uh, extensive research and extensive time. And I put a lot of effort into this. Um, so in my research paper, I made a correlation between listening and perception and the main relation between the two are they're both receptive aspects of interpersonal communication. Um, perception is an act of examining, selecting, organizing, as well as interpreting stimuli. And stimuli can be both external and internal. Anything that can trigger certain behavioral or physical changes is considered a stimuli. Perception affects our communication because individual people will respond to different stimuli differently because everyone's different, of course. Listening is misconceptualized as a physical act, but it's really actually mental. It relies on a lot of parts of the brain. Um, it's an active process that involves receiving, retaining, and constructing particulars from whoever you're communicating with. <clears throat> In my research, I explore the perception importance and the listening importance factors. And essentially listening is a mental process by analyzing messages and contemplating the message on how you choose to respond is the perceiving, is the perceiving piece. So active versus passive listening. I'm just going to quickly describe that because that kind of solidifies all the information. Um, so active or passive listening. Active listening is active intention in listening. So it means that you actually care about what you're listening to. It's imply It implies listening with intent. And whoever's Perceiving this clearly understands what the person is speaking and what they're talking about and they understand the overall message and then passive <clears throat> is essentially one-sided one side communication So yeah, um, active listening is 100% what we want Passive is not necessarily the best though an example of passive listening would be listening to my speech or watching a lecture or something like that because it's just one-sided um but yeah thank you for listening that's all folks